Overall, thought we got what we needed to get out of it. It's one of those games where it's tough, you know, when you allow good guards, and there's a lot of good guards at all levels, and it doesn't matter whether it's Division III, NAI Division II. When we gave, you know, their two guards, Herman and Romero, some confidence early on by seeing their ball go in, that allowed them to have the night they had where they had 30 and 34 respectively, which that's not acceptable. You're not going to win the league if you're allowing guys to go for 64 points. But at the same time, too, we also wanted to make sure that they beat us with twos. We did a great job of taking away the three up until the last four minutes of the game. They hadn't made a three for as a team. They only had gotten one attempt up, and I think our three-point field goal defense actually had a lot to do with that. And that's just good for the new guys, especially the guys that were sitting out last year, Anthony Johnson, Andre Spite, and Tanner Morgan, to get back in front of the crowd, to get their feet wet. Anthony, he showed no rust, shot the right shots. When he shoots great shots, he's going to shoot a great percentage. When he shoots okay shots, that percentage is going to dip. And then Andre Spite, who fought some foul trouble there, he's a guy that really hadn't ran into anybody in practice all year. And lo and behold, he gets three charges called against him. But I mean, I think people can see, I mean, he can put the ball in the basket really easy. And that's the thing with this team. Those guys can go get 30 on any given night. It's a matter of that fine line of making sure that we got good ball movement and not becoming too much of an isolation team. And then I thought the guys off the bench really did a great job of understanding their role. Those guys off the bench played to their strengths, didn't show their weaknesses, gave us a big lift, especially in the first half. That group that came in there towards the end of the first half kind of gave us that cushion when Andre and Anthony were in foul trouble. I know exactly what CSU is going to do. I mean, there's no tricks to what Coach Stacy and those guys are going to do, but if we're not ready to come out and we're not ready to fight from the get-go, it'll be a long day. And for us to have an opportunity to play against some good guards after playing this team, we're going to challenge our guys to make sure that those guys just don't go off and score 64 points collectively. But I think it's a great time for us to play somebody else, especially the caliber of CSU, and for us to have that leading into the CU game, I think ultimately it's really going to help our team take another step in the right direction.